law, then the rule inevitably default to, to US law, which isn't necessarily going to suit everybody here if they have to go to the central states to appeal something or to sue on something. But um, we're doing that already, being that a lot of the legislation, a lot of law would have come through uh, with US FDA. Um, and potentially, uh, right, right now, if you look at the news, you see a lot of, well, there's, there's acts being put in front of US Congress, but they're not really, really good at passing anything, including budgets. So whether or not they'll be able to pass <coughs> and perhaps make these rules and regulations stronger is, is up for the question. Hollywood throws a lot of money at the politicians. I'm sure they can get any law passed they want. So we're doomed. Um, <laughs> but basically, if we're going to be copying legislation, how do, how do we then find out? So again, talking about the present, how do we find out what rules and regulations are coming through, what uh, updates to regulations are coming through? There was a, an article that I, I posted out that talked about, it was just a minor change that happened, and you know, it was a small little article that said, you know, we've just changed a, a couple of sentences here and there, just to, just to clean it up. Um, how do we know that they're not cleaning us out of house and home in terms of the use of our content? No, no, so in terms of changing regulations. Yeah, it is a really good question. To, to stay away from the sort of house and home bit, but to stay on the regulations bit, um, usually these things are worked out through case law, and it's actually not very much, there really isn't hardly any case law around um, copyright infringements, the jump between the United States and Australia and, and sharing these laws at the moment. Good point, Nick. Oh, yeah, do you have a good example? Because I, I, yeah. Could you share it? There's a famous defamation case in Australia. I can't remember it was Good Nick Reed and somebody. And it talks about the place of publication. And a lot of the laws that we're talking about will be grandfathered into the Australian legislation once they're passed in the US. If the current talks go the way they're going, and they'll also be picked up by the EU and the UK. So we're going to see US copyright law take over based on the current negotiations that are happening. Oh, rapture. Yeah. <laughs>